Good morning everyone. So we are back out here on the farm and I had a couple of requests today for animals that uh, would be shown in the video. So um, over here we're going to try to grant a couple of those requests. We've got a couple of cows in the background that I'll show you a little bit closer. <laughs> some of the donkeys and I put some feed out, some grain out to hopefully get them to come a little bit closer so we could see it and hopefully they don't start fighting. Um, there was also a request for a chicken and a rooster and there was a chicken out here a minute ago I don't know where he went off to but I can hear a rooster in the background so maybe they'll come out and so today we're going to talk about goods and services and a good is something that is made or grown and usually it's something that somebody will buy so You've got canned goods. That's a good, like pineapple. This is for Ethan. Books are goods. It's made for somebody to use. Clothes are goods. Puzzles and games, those are goods. And also things that we grow, like this is a zucchini. This came out of my garden. It came out of my garden a while ago, but it's still pretty good. This is a good. It's something that is made or grown and then people can buy it. So for instance, right here, all the donkeys are up over here because I fed them some grain. A grain is a good. It's something that is made or grown. Now, <laughs> there's another rooster. A service, those are jobs that people have and they're jobs that people do to help others. So, <laughs> So a dentist provides a service to others. His job is to help. A doctor provides a service. A doctor helps others. I'm a teacher. A teacher provides a service. I help others. And you know what? We're out here on the farm today. A farmer provides a service to us because the things that a farmer does with growing food or growing grain or helping to raise up animals, those help others. They provide a service to others. Okay, so I'm going to, this, the dogs just realized that I was here. I'm going to turn the camera around so you can see a couple of these animals. All right, so we have some donkeys over here and the donkeys are over here eating the grain right now. I brought grain over in the bucket. The grain is a good and it's something that the donkeys can eat. Here are all, well not all the donkeys, about a quarter of the donkeys that we have around here. And we have a couple of cows that are up here also. These two cows um, are some of the, just a couple of the cows that we have on the farm. These are cows that um, had calves that we weaned. You remember yesterday we took calves, or we did a video from the calves in the lot. Um, so their calves are old enough now that they don't need to be around their mom anymore. But eventually these cows will have new babies. And way down there at that pond, you can see some ducks down there. Those ducks provide us eggs for the farm. All right. Now these donkeys, they don't really provide any goods for the farm or provide a service for us. They don't help us pull a wagon or anything. They're just kind of fun to have around. Oh, and there's one of the dogs. She's going to come check me out. All right, so now that you've had a chance to see some of the animals that we have on the farm, some of the donkeys, and a couple of the cows, I'm going to turn you back around. And if you are one of my students, you are going to do an activity on Seesaw for goods and for services. We'll see you later.